what's good youtube it's your boy praise and today is another day in my life so guys um as you can see my camera is actually very very clear and yeah so we added to the team a new phone so guys yeah i got a new phone yesterday so um yeah uh, let me show you guys now so in case you're new to this channel my name is praise and what do i do here i document my life i share my losses wins and everything you need to become a forex successful forex trader I share my journey for both professionals and newbies to show you that it's possible to make it to in the forex market so you don't give up at any point in time in case you're new to this channel you can go back to my previous video and watch um, and see how I started all the way to this point so if that's something you're interested in please leave a like and subscribe to my channel thank you so much Seven. this is the carton i'm going to i'm using the phone to video right now i'm going to switch to my old phone this is my old phone and then i'm going to use this phone to um record this one so yeah guys yeah this is the phone so i'm using my old phone now to um record it so that's why the camera is not working so i got so many requests from youtubers that i should get a more clear um camera so i got this and this is 70 gram guys stop playing guys stop playing all this is achieved through our forex guys stop playing stop playing click the link in the description if you want to join my mentorship guys wow this is epic guys i don't really know what comes next i'm just doing my best even though i'm so stressed out Everything just feels like a test that I feel so depressed when I can't seem to get out But something deep inside won't let me quit I swear that I'm inspired by all this shit Tell me that I can't and I won't That's what guides me the most You lies, I'll do what I want By thirst, I'm inspired by worth. I desire your worst, so you can just hide while I work. I ain't tired, you first. I'll write a second, third verse about the lies you go disperse. You never did, sh I know it hurts. But something What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Praise, and today is another day in my life. So, in case you're new to this channel, my name is Praise, and what do I do here? I document my life, I share my losses, wins, and so many things you be need to become a successful forest trader. So, if that's something you're interested in, please leave a like and subscribe. So, yeah, I'm currently out doing nothing because there's no light. My system is off, but uh, that will not stop us from taking a trade. So I took a trade this morning. Look at it. I shared it in my signals room. And yeah, I'm just going to do the breakdown of what I saw before I took this trade. And so yeah, that's uh, pretty much all. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Follow me as inst on Instagram at PraiseBanksFX. Yeah, on Instagram. Follow me on Instagram at PraiseBanksFX. Join my Telegram group because I share educational content there that people don't usually share on YouTube. Also share with signals. Peace. So what's up guys? This is the trade I was telling you guys about. So this is the trade I took and as you can see this was a massive drop and it was a sniper entry. That's the most important part of this trade. We cut it at the week, so let me screenshot it so I can send it to my telegram group. I share the signals with my telegram group members. So if you have not joined, join. You can see this is a big move and I pretty much stuck position on this my problem. So yeah, I've passed this one, this one of my problem pass. I just passed the challenge with this group, guys. So, yeah, with the ultra order block strategy, everything is possible, guys. Yeah, there's nothing impossible with the ultra order block strategy. This was a simple move, so, yeah. I'm just leaving one position to run, and I'll do a full trade breakdown on what I saw uh, before I took this trade. So, just keep watching this video, because I'm going to do full analysis. Okay, see you later. What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Praise, and I just want to do the trade breakdown of the trade I took um today. So, yeah, 
what I saw before I took the trade. So guys, this are my, this is my chart and I'm on the daily time frame. So let me go to the one to the one hour time frame. So guys, yeah. So this is the trade I took. This whole trade here. Yeah, this is down move. This is down move. Yeah. We can see I closed over here, but uh, the trade kept running to this point. So um, yeah. What did I say before taking this trade? So. You guys um might be seeing all these lines on my chart and might say um my psychological levels are too much. Well these are not psychological levels. These are what I call bank zones and yeah, this is some of the things I teach my students. So each time price that's the bank zone they can be reaction over here, over here. Um just every time it happens. And these zones are the zones that price um that the smart money obeys but enough of that let me just um pretty much to tell you what i saw here before um taking this trade so what can we see <coughs> so um from here guys you can see we have this trend line liquidity sorry okay it's not trend line liquidity I'm just really um tired today. Yeah. So I'm gonna change the color of this quickly so you guys will be able to see it. And I'm gonna change the pixel so hope you can all see this line clearly. So we have this um liquidity price tapped it once, um twice and um, three times. And then what can we notice here? This is just um simple logic. So I always tell my students trading is simple. You just gonna think in a smart way. So sorry guys, we have a down move followed by an up move. Then a down move. Like I always tell my students to just always do this. So after the down move, we have another up move. And then we have a down move. So from here we're expecting a buy. But we can see that price now came up failed to take out this high and then came and started consolidating inside here so with normal sense i already knew that okay price is tired of buying and we can expect to drop so this is first um based on probability thinking so i always tell my students think in terms of probability price went down up down up and down up so after a down move, there must be an up move. So we can see the price failed to take out that high. So that was a first confidence that gold is going to sell. So let me delete that now. I'm going to take you to the 15 minutes. So I'll show you something else I saw. So guys, this is this is um, you know the kind of value I'm giving you guys with doing this analysis because. If you incorporate this um, into your charts, then you will not have problems. So you can see the trend line there. Yeah. What can we see here? Go over here. Let me get it out. We can see that price is reacting. After price went up, came down, and then it tapped here. This is a bank zone. This is a my mini bank zone. It came down, reacted. It couldn't break it. Came down. It thought touch. It came down, and then it went up. And then this was where I took a sell. I also took a buy here, but this one was a loss. So at first, before all this happened, there was a way this chart was looking. Even though we were still looking for sales but i was thinking price is going to maybe still go up small so i was scalping but this was a loss so we left it so when this move happened this big bearish move okay i already knew that okay yeah price is going to drop we just need to wait for retracement 
to price retrace mainly price retrace that came back to this our bank zone level so this our bank zone was very strong so yeah to this point that's where i got in and um, as you can see immediately price dropped immediately you can see that price dropped guys <laughs> sharp so that was how i caught that big move on gold so you can see that price drops all the way if you notice price dropped all the way to this my bank zone and is then reacting currently off it so i'm doing this analysis in the night so all this is asian session and i'm expecting price to keep going up in the london session is going to take out the asian high and then we can continue dropping maybe we can react from this bank zone because this bank zone aligns with the breaker the breaker block so yeah if price gets here we can definitely want to sell so trading is as easy guys it's just for you to be under the right mentorship and just know what you're doing you're just going to have to think well so this move was not at all hard in any way um to catch you will even notice we caught a move right from here so yeah but this was um a really big move and then yeah one of our biggest moves this week was this one so this one so even i held this trade this was when i told um by vip members to close our board. i held this trade up the, all the way to this bank zone when i saw weak rejection that was when um, i closed this trade so i backed like 184 pips um, on gold So, yeah, that's all. So, where's our buyers now good for today? I've told you before, we have to wait for price to enter this bank zone, this zone, or highest this zone, because we have a draw on liquidity, and then price has to go and take out this our draw. This point here is um my draw on liquidity, and these are things um, I teach my students every day so now before we go forward i just want to show you guys a quick analysis on the xy or what is gonna happen to the dollar in the future so i'm gonna start with the daily time frame Oh, sorry guys, I put it in one minute, one day. Okay, yeah. So guys, what can we see here? We can see, um, if I zoom in like this, on the XY, you can see that we had, um, this trend line and uh, that kind of broke the same thing and then as the trend line broke um there was like a change of character then it retraced and then price went up you know that kind of thing price went up and then dropped but yeah also looking to the left around here i can see that price started to on um, other block So, guys, yeah, this is a very strong order block. This is not an ultra order block, but this is a strong order block. Why is this um, a strong order block? It's because according to smart money concepts and ICT concepts, you know, any other blocks that takes out liquidity is um, is definitely a strong block. So, if you look here, liquidity was taken out by this week. So, this other block is valid and there's a probability that price could um, start going up right from this point. I also want to take note of the sweep of the previous day high. So, like I said, price also took out the previous day high.
и Афсов. Thus a liquidity sweep and as price took out the previous he had price went and lose right here so let me get my arrow again price took the high now with this other day can do and close above it so where is our next drone on liquidity we have this point this high so what this candle can do is go down just maybe during the london session maybe a small down move and then price will go up and take out this side because this side now will be our draw on liquidity and when price takes out this side if it sweeps it and then our next draw on liquidity will be the draw will be the low of the other candles so guys trading is just um logic you just have to think in probabilities guys and there are so many ways to think in probabilities so this is our draw on liquidity for today on um for the xy so that's what we can be expecting just a small so if i go to the one hour yeah just like i say price might just want to come down small so maybe to any of these zone so i've not really had time to mark zones on and um, i've not had time to mark zones on the xy but i'll do that i've only marked on gold and euro usd but we can see maybe price come down here or anywhere just anywhere or to take out or to just to tap into this imbalance anyhow price want to do it well that's our draw it's just for us to find bullish um oh, yeah price can just generally react from this point but anyhow anything that happens is price so i want to show you guys something on good So yeah, I have other gold charts. So you can see those lines are not showing. Sometimes if I want to see the charts clearly, I switch to another gold chart to um actually see things clearly and know what I'm doing. <laughs> so guys after we had noticed that price was actually going out from our bank zone what gave me a strong confidence of this trade was i saw an ultra order block so yeah somewhere around here so this was my ultra order block type 4 so this is so powerful i could have decided to re-enter but i'm already in an entry so i could have entered here sorry this I could have entered here, but I'm already in an entry, so if I enter there, my stop loss will just be um, above it. Price won't play with other other blocks. Sharp sweep reaction. It's four pips cost already. It's four pips. So yeah. That's why we could have entered and did this. So let's see which of my bank zones price will react from. Well, it's very easy to know where price is gonna react from. If price taps in to an, a bank zone and then an engulfing cap <coughs> and then maybe there's an engulfing like now when price taps into my bank zone and it's this red candle and then the next candle was a bullish one, so which engulfed this one. I wait for it to close immediately i enter so you can check on 15 minutes or 5 minutes and as you can see rally upward and i'm they have colors so if you notice this is thick orange and this is thick purple because of the um so when i was marking them purple ones are the monthly bank zones this orange one are the hourly and the four hours and then all these ones are the middle this gray ones these are now the entry day 15 minutes five minutes bank zones so yeah you can see as price stops into this one price went up and then yeah after no engulfing figure already been made here but you can see the bullish pressure i've seen an ultra order block already so i can enter this street right from here and we put our stop loss below here and then we take profits maybe this zone but this zone is more likely to hold because there's some kind of support here and there's imbalance if we are trading our own concepts so this zone is likely to hold 
yeah that's pretty much all guys if you enjoyed the lesson please leave a like and subscribe to my channel if you want to join my mentorship click the link in the description to message me all these things are things i teach my students so peace so what's up guys it's your boy praise and i just came back from work so yeah i want to eat and this is what i want to eat so i'll show you guys now if this is indomie so there's no light now but i cooked this this is fish and indomie I mean sardine with indomie so I'm just gonna eat this now. If you watched it up to this point, I really appreciate you guys. So, uh, um, thank you so much for watching it to this point. If you like what I'm doing on this channel, please support me, like and subscribe. It will really help me. So I want to first thank all of you that subscribe to my channel. So we are in 400 subscribers now and we are aiming to hit 1k. So guys, thank you so much for subscribing to my channel. If you have not subscribed, Please leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Leave a like as it will help YouTube to boost the video. Thank you so much, guys. So, this video is already too long. I cannot feel myself putting this again. But, good night. Peace. I don't really know what comes next. I'm just doing my best, even though I'm so stressed out. Everything just feels like a test that I feel so depressed when I can't seem to get out. But something deep inside.